UK bodybuilding is in crisis. With growing numbers of competitors opting for more accessible fitness-based competitions, and with controversy and discourse within the established federations in the UK, traditional bodybuilding is at risk of being squeezed out. But after three years away from the sport, two veterans of the UK bodybuilding scene are out to prove they'll do whatever it takes to win a British title. I don't train to lose, and Paul doesn't train to lose. I would like it to brothers, actually. It has been said that we look like brothers. I personally don't see it because I'm much better looking and taller than him. We're quite similar, um, except that he's like 40 years older than me. For real men, use this. That's my applause. As Tom and Paul prepare for their return to bodybuilding, we find out what happens when best friends become rival competitors on the same stage. You know, I've taken gear for, for years, and but I've never beaten up my girlfriends. A testosterone product, a product called Trembolone, Mastron. Just Google pro steroid cycles. That advice is normally given by idiot. Four grams of test prop a week. What a fucking joke. I'm gonna have to go team Tom at this point, but don't tell him that. <laughs> There's always competition, isn't there? But that makes you want to be better. He's judging, you can see he's still got the passion for it, and he still wants to be up there. Ah! Come on. Oh, yeah. His dad will get grumpy when he's dying. I have more titles than Tom. This is not following a diet. This is not getting fit. This is not drugs doing the work. This is whatever it takes. This is prep.